headed into Cades Cove. We are going to head back to Abrams Falls here in the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. Now 95% of this is motorized. Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Wednesday you are not allowed to drive your motor vehicles through here. You have to park and bike or hike. We are going to go on this amazing hike up here when we get there and I'll be glad to show you. So we are entering the Cades Cove Loop. It's 11 miles. It closes at dusk. It is currently 3 o'clock in the afternoon. We will be out of here before then. So stay tuned guys. Hope you all enjoy. Alrighty guys, this is the beauty of the National Park here in Cades Cove. Just look at it all. So peaceful, so tranquil, so desolate, like it's a vacationer's paradise. Take some romantic photos with those nice mountains in the background, everything. Engagement photos, wedding photos, a beautiful venue to have a wedding outdoors. And again, you need that vacation planner. Send that email to destinationsdelight96 at gmail.com for all your booking needs. Beautiful, guys. Simply beautiful. Alrighty, guys. You can see this long line of cars in front of me. If you're hiking in the National Park and you come across this, nine times out of the ten, it's either A, you're coming up to a bear jam, which means there is a bear sighting, or B, it's just people who don't know how to drive and don't know where they're going. And they think they see things and people will park on the main road when they're not supposed to. And rangers try their best to keep things moving along gracefully so that way people don't get stuck and frustrated out here, like myself, who are trying to get to a destination to go enjoy the beautiful scenery. But keep in mind, folks, that nine times out of 10, it's a bear jam. So let's see what we can see as we get further along the way. Alrighty. Alrighty guys, so this is what the jam is all about. Wild turkeys and deer right up close to the roadway. And I'm trying to pay attention to the people in front of me because everybody just, I don't know. If you're not from where I'm from, I guess deer are hard to see. And they're so tamed and so pretty. They can eat right out of your hand if you allow them to. Aren't they gorgeous? Again, beautiful sights for days. Check this out. Beautiful sightings, you can see. Pull in the parking and go check everything out guys that's all you got to do pull yourself into the parking lot and walk back on the trail so you can see these beautiful things see how close they get to your vehicle See how close they get right there next to my car? And they just sit here and they eat. So beautiful. Yes, you are. You're so beautiful. Alrighty guys, here's the entrance to Abrams Falls. We're gonna go do this hike and just see how marvelous it is. Keep in mind, you're in the Great Smoky Mountains National Park here, um, so be prepared. If you wanna do this hike, get here early. Don't do what I do. Come halfway through the day and expect to go hike a five mile hike round trip and get out of here before dark. So let's go try it. Alrighty guys, so We're here on the Abrams Falls hike. And as you can tell, it is not paved. It is a little rough terrain, not too bad. But I just started, so it's a two and a half mile hike in, two and a half mile hike out. 
So take your time, know what you're doing, be aware of your surroundings, and listen, large crackles, that's bear. I'm telling you, and they will come up out of you like nowhere. So be prepared, have fun, and enjoy this hike. Beautiful hike, guys. Check out the river below. So pretty. So, so pretty. So guys, the only thing that scares me about being out here alone while hiking is a, there's not a buddy system, for one. For two, I don't have bear spray, I don't have a bear horn, I don't have any of that. So I'm going to be putting some things on my bucket list items that I need to get, linking them all down in my description to my Amazon account. Um... Because there's going to be much more of these coming up this summer that I plan on doing. I'm going to try to hit as many national parks as I can this year. Earn some more stickers. Build my book. And just enjoy life over the summer. I know I'm going to be out in Arizona for a week or more. I'll be in Vegas. So there's some national parks I definitely want to hit. But by the time you guys see this video... I may be already back home. So, yeah, I just want to tell all my amazing supporters and my amazing friends out there, if you don't think you can do it, just go try it. Enjoy life. Who cares if you don't make it all the way? Set that goal for the next time that you guys get out here and do a beautiful hike, wherever it is, you know. It don't necessarily have to be where I'm at, maybe there's a hike around you that you've been wanting to do yourself there. Just enjoy life. Enjoy life to its fullest. Keep in mind, stay healthy, stay fit, eat right, put your mind to it, and you can overcome any obstacle that's in your way. So we're going to try this for as long as we can. Keeping an eye on the time because the park does close here at dusk and your girl does not want to be stuck in the woods in the dark. So we're going to rock and roll. I did talk to some people that said they did see some bear. So I'm praying to God we don't come across that. So guys, the ground is a little wet. Like I said, just be prepared. Check your surroundings. Know what you're getting yourself into. And just have fun while you do it all. This hike is simply beautiful. Amazing steps cut into the surroundings. But just be careful, guys, when you're doing this. Remember, stay alert. Stay mindful. Listen. Listen to what nature's trying to tell you. Our first little bridge that you get to walk across. So beautiful. Alrighty guys, um, we're about to enter the falls. I just want to tell you, don't ever let any disability overcome any one of you guys. I'm a proving fat. You know, I got two collapsed discs, two sets of bone spurs in my neck. I have an L345 fusion. I have a failed back fusion. I have a spinal cord stimulator implant device. And I did it. I did it. This whole trip was all about making me a better person and bringing amazing content to each and every one of you guys. And I am 
a little overwhelmed with emotions because it was hard. I wanted to turn back a couple of times, but I kept going. I walked the two and a half miles and it took me a little bit over an hour. We're gonna go see some falls and then I'm gonna walk the two and a half miles out and I'll come back to you when I'm at the car. Let's go guys. Alrighty guys, let's go scope this out. Got a nice couple across, I crossed across a couple of these. Glad I'm not the only one out here. I was worried that I was gonna be the only one out here. Whew. I made it, I feel great. I just wanna get some photos and then we're out of here. I'm just videotaping it. Abrams Falls, guys. What a beauty. People swimming out there to go into the falls. See, guys, living proof. I made it. Might have a red face, a lot of sweat, but hey, I did it. Don't let your disability consume your life. Get out and enjoy the world and have a little fun while doing it. Look what the beauty of nature brings to you. And I'm so happy that I was able to bring this all to you. Alrighty guys, there you have it, Abrams Falls. What a beautiful hike. It literally took an hour to get back here. Maybe a little over an hour and a half. We're gonna try it going out, see how long it takes me getting out. And, um, yeah, don't let your disabilities consume what you do. Get out, explore, enjoy the world, and just have fun while doing it, guys. So if you guys all enjoyed this little hiking vlog that we did, and I'll show you some stuff on the way out, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell, and give it a thumbs up, and leave a comment down below, and let me know where you're tuning in from. And until next time, guys, be safe, happy trails, and stay friendly. And remember, safety is the key. And until next time, have a delightful destination. Bye, all. So, guys, as you can see, it's a beautiful hike. I will be honest. You know, coming up that hill after getting down to the falls, I struggled a little bit. Um, I broke down. I thought I was going to not make it back. And I had to actually sit down for a good 25 minutes, catch my breath, lower my heart rate, drink some water, and just breathe. Meditate. Get your breathing under control. Take the backpack off or your pa water pack, whatever you're carrying, and just breathe. Key things to remember when you're out on this hike. You know, your breathing, your hiking, your surroundings, the noise of nature, all major, major, major things that you need to do when hiking in the Great Smoky Mountains National Parks. Mm-hmm.
That is a big boy. Thing's about that big. Hello, beauties. I wonder if these are the ones that were. I only saw one on the trailer. She looks pregnant. That's what I was saying. It's probably me. That means there's a buck around here, so be careful. Yeah. They're it's like not rut season yet. We would have heard it up and down on the way through. So beautiful. You know what I like about the deer here? Is they allow you to get close to them. Only in caves go. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're just so desensitized to people. Yeah, they don't have to worry about hunting. Alrighty, guys. I made it back to the truck. I met some three young teenagers along the way. I walked back with them. Amazing kids. They're from around here. Y'all know who you are if you're watching this video. Thank you for the company. Thank you for the talk. It really got me through it and I greatly appreciate you three. So I hope you all have an amazing time. I hope you guys all like this video. And if you guys do, don't forget to like, subscribe, ring that notification bell, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought of it. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching and enjoy your day. Bye y'all.